Welcome to Sackcrete Pro Tips, consistencies of repair materials. When you are doing a concrete repair project, you're going to need to adjust your materials for best consistency to fix whatever the scenario is. So let's look at three common states. Loose or fluid. That's a good application when you're going to do a, a slurry coat and, and, and parge it down just to fix some imperfections in the slab, make a nice coating. The middle is kind of where you're going to use most. Think of it as oatmeal. Oatmeal is not fluid, but it's still very malleable. So that is where most of your patching will take place. And then there's going to be those cases where you're going to need to sculpt it into the repair. Think of that as a glistening snowball. You're going to mix it dry enough, and, and believe me, you're going to have to stick your hands in to get it to this state where it holds together, but you see there's a, a reflection of water. That, that's the glistening of the glistening snowball. If I don't see this water present on the outside, I've mixed it too dry and the patch will fail. Of course, in real life, your repairs are gonna be here and everywhere in between.